The Marquis is an all-electric SUV with those distinctive pony haunches, familiar shark nose, and a sticker price of 45,000 US dollars. Ford sold more than 10 million Mustangs since its debut in 1964, but the electric version will be the first time it's been configured into a sport utility vehicle. Ford claims its electric pony can do 0 to 60 faster than Porsche's Macan SUV. The company plans to build the Marquis in Mexico and says it's going to be profitable from the outset in both the US and Europe, something that automakers have really struggled to do when it comes to electric vehicles globally. I spoke to Ford CEO Jim Hackett. We've got a price point with the Marquis base uh, package that's in the mid 30,000 with the incentive, with the federal incentive here in the United States. And so it's going to be attractive to customers. It's going to make a contribution margin. Uh, it's a great story. Ford struggled to sell electrified versions of its existing sedan range, and actually it pulled the plug on an electrified Focus last year and is moving away from sedans altogether. The company's strategy now is really to electrify its top sellers, starting with the Mustang Mach-E and moving on to the pickup truck, the F-150, but we don't have a timeline for that yet. It's part of an $11.5 billion plan to electrify the fleet. They want 40 electric vehicles on the roads by 2022, but they're pushing deeper into what is essentially a crowded field. LMC Automotive is forecasting that there will be more than 100 electrified models from different automakers on U.S. roads by the mid-2020s. And Ford has some catching up to do when it comes to convincing consumers. In a recent survey by car gurus, Ford placed fifth behind the likes of Tesla and Toyota in terms of which automakers consumers would consider buying an electric vehicle from. The Mustang Mach-E goes on sale in the U.S. next fall. Ford won't say how many vehicles they expect to sell annually. CEO Jim Hackett told me that it was just going to be a lot. But we know that the Mexico plant has capacity of around 100,000 vehicles a year. And LMC Automotive are forecasting that Ford could potentially be doing 50,000 Mach-E's annually by 2021. Ed Ludlow, Bloomberg News, Los Angeles.